by Alexander Miladinov and Krasimir Grozov in Sofia, Bulgaria is to restart its fighter procurement initiative, following recommendations made by a parliamentary investigation board after its review of the decision to name Saab and CD as preferred candidate. The review board, which completed its work on 20 September, indicates that a combined offer of used Lockheed Martin F-16s submitted by the governments of Portugal and the USA was disqualified in an improper manner, preventing a fair evaluation of all submitted bids. Sources suggest that the offer was disqualified because a request for a deferred payment scheme failed to comply with Sophia's requirements. In its report, the Investigation Board recommends that the Defense Ministry rework the requirements contained in its request for proposals, and expand the number of countries which will receive an invitation to participate in the government or government tender. A decision on how to proceed sits with Defense Minister Krasimir Karakarchanov. Bulgaria wants to purchase two batches of eight fighters each, and had allocated 767 million euros $900 million for the first phase, also including a small package of air-to-air -air and air-to-surface weapons, a simulator, logistics support and training services. Saab in April, a tender commission named the Gripen as preferred candidate, after it received the highest score in its evaluation. An Italian government offer using Tranche 1 standard second-hand Eurofighter Typhoons was ranked in second position. A final decision was deferred until after Bulgaria's new government entered office in early May. Prime Minister Boyko Borisov has questioned the need to acquire new fighters, and suggested that the Gripen is far from the best choice for the nation, and his centre-right GERB party has voiced its support for the option of purchasing F-16s. The U.S. government in Lockheed delivered an unsolicited proposal in March 2017 promoting new build examples in a Block 70 standard. Bulgarian President and former Air Force Commander and Chef Ruman Radev opposes Borisov's view, and notes that the Swedish type complies with the terms of the earlier request for proposals. Borisov also has suggested that Bulgaria could consider ordering a cheaper combat aircraft, such as Textron Airlines Scorpion, which visited the country in June 2015. Another factor in Bulgaria's indecisiveness on the new fighter procurement stems from its willingness to maintain good relations with Russia, allowing investment in keeping its current MiG-29 and Sukhoi Su-25 fleets in operational condition. Kara Karchanov believes the types could fly on until around 2030.